Good morning, good afternoon, or good night, or whatever time it may be in your part of the world. My name is Mr. John Wayne, and I am a variety gamer. I play everything from the Fallout franchise all the way to the Soulsborne series. Welcome, everybody, to another episode of my 100% walkthrough of Fallout 4. I hope you're all doing well. I know that I am. And today, we are going to be doing the quest for Bobby No-Nos. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. First things first, let's go ahead and go to put on the quest for Bobby Nonos. It's a miscellaneous. Hey, you looking for work? Depends on the work. You'll never find a more fair and honest job. If you don't mind a little manual labor and don't ask too many questions, you're in. I'll give you 50 caps to start. Interested? I'm gonna need more to go on here. There's a project I'm working on. A big one. One that could get me into lots of trouble if the wrong person finds out. So little discretion is called for. I got a delicate house of cards going here, you know? You can do better than that. Fine. Take a hundred up front. This is just a bad deal. Ah, uh, you're killing me here. One fifty to start. Still not good enough. Two hundred. And that's as high as I go. <laughs> Jeez, I gotta watch out for this one. I'm in. That's what I like to hear. Let's go inside. I'll give you the lowdown. Stood on our Pip Boy lamp. Make sure we have the big dig quest toggled on. Ready to get to work? No, I followed you down here for the exercise. Funny. Well, you'll get plenty of exercise here. You are going to be doing some digging. Digging? <laughs> this is a waste of my talents. <laughs> you want a better job? You got to work your way up to it, buddy. Show me that can-do attitude. The other two are down there digging already. Go give them a hand, will you? By the way, I forgot to tell everybody, McCready likes when you're being sarcastic as well. Hey, I think we can finally get through. Want to see what's on the other side? Oh, yeah. You think Bobby will pay us this week? I don't know, man. I'm starting to feel like we're doing charity. Did you just hear something? It's crawling with Meyer lurks. Bail! Bobby can take this job and shut it. Bring in the pain. <laughs> Hope that wasn't your shooting hand. Go ahead and heal ourselves. What is going on in my tunnel? Looks like we are having crab for dinner tonight. You'd eat my lurk? Ugh, no. Disgusting. Tough, but somehow slimy at the same time. Well, you stuck around at least. So I guess you're promoted. You get to be my new gun. I think we just need one more guy. An old friend. He'll want a fair cut, but we saw what being cheap got me. Who is this guy? He's just the guy we need to speed things along. Likes gadgets, money, and not much else. First, I think it's best if you actually see what we're after. I have some things to check on in Diamond City. Head over to the noodle shop there, and I'll meet you when I finish up my business. Let's exit out of Bobby's place.
Oh, I forgot to put a level in the last video. I apologize. Let's put it into perception. Now we just need one more level to finish perception up. We did already get the perception bobblehead when we first started the walkthrough when we went into the Museum of Freedom. So we're just going to go ahead and max perception out and maybe I will do cap collector next. Probably going to put that all the way up. Yeah, I'll definitely end up leveling that all the way up. Let's go ahead and fast travel over to Diamond City Market. Heard you're responsible for that new coat of green on the wall. Looks nice. Bobby. There you are. <laughs> Was wondering if you were going to show up. Yes, it's me. I have to hide my face in these parts. People like me aren't allowed around here. Now let's get down to business. That big wall of glass looming over Diamond City is the mayor's office. Most people don't know it, but there's a strong room buried beneath. Mayor's just sitting on top of it. And that's our target. The guy has it coming, if you ask me. With how he treats my kind, maybe he deserves worse. What's inside? Caps, meds, food. Enough to keep this city running. It's things we want. Things everyone wants. You get in on this, there's plenty for you. You got it? So, what do you say we make this party a little bigger? I managed to track down my tech guy. His name's Mel, and he is right here in Diamond City. The guy can make a gadget to solve any problem. Thing is, he's a bit locked up right now. You have to get him out of there. I can't just stroll into Diamond City security with this face, covered or not. If you really think we need this guy... Trust me, this is the guy we need. Pick a lock, find a key, bribe the guard. The usual stuff. Just get him out of there. Let's go to the Diamond City lockup. How come whenever something interesting happens around here, you're right in the center of it? Mel here. Can I help you? Do you come here often? You know, they always say you'll meet that special someone in the last place you expect. So why are you here? You want something from me, right? I am getting you out of here. If so, maybe you shouldn't be announcing it so every guard in Diamond City can hear. Um, totally unrelated. But I hear that there's an old glitched out Protectron unit back there. Guards asked me to take a look, but it was a real head scratcher. Couldn't do a thing. <laughs> He's such a liar with that. Tech guy not being able to fix a Protectron? Yeah, okay. Hope you didn't run into any trouble getting here. That bridge across the river. Super mutants use it as an ambush point. Officer? You got something to say? I was hoping to get... Mel at a lockup. I didn't know Mel had friends. All right. He's pretty much done his time. Let me open up the door. All right. You're free to go, buddy. Let's just get out of here. You watch your step. Got my eye on you. We'll meet Mel outside. Thanks for getting me out, I guess. So, you're Bobby's new toy. Yep, this year's hottest gift. Get one before they're gone. And what a gift you'd be. God, that woman doesn't have a patient bone in her body. I wasn't serving a life sentence here. What, she couldn't wait like a day? What's the job? 
How'd you like to help break into the Diamond City strong room? Well, damn. That's a big score. Could be enough caps there to keep me going for a long time. Bobby may be shady, but she always pays up in the end. So, I guess I'll get my stuff and head over to her place. Now we're going to fast travel back over to Good Neighbor. Let's go into Bobby's place and go talk to Mel and Bobby. into trouble again, Mel? What can I say? I learned from the best. I'm flattered. So, what's the deal with the new all guy? All right, we're all here. Mel, you want to introduce your little friend? Yep. Meet Sonia. This little bot is going to help us move through the earth like a mole rat on jet. I'm excited to see what she can do. <laughs> I can't wait to show you. She's one of a kind. <laughs> I modified her radio systems to emit sonic pulses at frequencies that can loosen any sediment around. Mel says we'll be able to get to the strong room ten times faster than just digging. And it's a hell of a lot safer than loading this place up with dynamite. All right, guys, get ready. I'm not completely sure how this place will respond. So, uh, brace yourselves. Sonia, do your thing. Oh, I got lucky with this one. Came right up to my door and took the job. He takes orders, and he's useful in a fight. What more could I want? And he's not so bad to look at, either. Maybe we don't burn bridges this time, yeah? Yeah, their dialogue got cut off, unfortunately. Sorry about that. I don't know why it does that sometimes. Should be another Meyer Lurk over here. Uh, again with the Looks like a legendary. And yeah. all right, just push me towards the Meyer Lurk, huh? You pay for that. Jesus. Bad situation just got worse. That wasn't so bad. Well, it kind of was. I almost died, Mel. Yeah, I don't want that. Let's go ahead and shoot these eggs. Probably be easier dealing with the hatchlings at this point. We need Sonya here. Sonya, you know. Can't see shit. I know there's a Meyer Lurk King over here. <coughs> Jesus. This is a bad. I don't know about you, but this seems like a dead end to me. Let's see if we can backtrack and blast another path. I'm going to go ahead and take all this X01. Hey. Well, let's see what you got. Okay, I just needed to get some of that stuff off of me and give it to McCready for now. Over here is where we need to go. Mel, get Sonya over here. Gotcha. Sonya. We're going to stay topped off. Got some more Meyer Lurks over here. Oh, shit. Good thing we're inside. I forgot that we had the stupid um, flares on. Oh, 
Lots of legendary Mylurks down here, huh? Die already. Oh, what the fuck just happened? They just climbed the wall like that? Jesus. Well, maybe it just like left. Oh. <laughs> Holy. Holy shit. That's how that thing is an acrobat. No, uh, that's not bad. That's actually not bad at all. I don't know if it's sturdy combat armor or not. That's really what's going to determine if I want to use it or not. We need to get through here, Mel. No problem. Come on, Sonya. Hopefully I don't get a strike for this iBot having music on it. So dumb because you can barely hear it, but it's on there. I don't know why. Stupid ghoul die. I'm not afraid of you. Mel, you're fighting ghouls with a knife. Good luck, bud. <laughs> Good luck. Looks like a subway tunnel. Then we're on the right track. Aha, I see what you did there. What? No. Just keep heading southwest. We need to find a place to blast out of these tunnels. If you want, you can hack that terminal or that door back there. Gary. It's <laughs> a lot of, um, of those blocks, those letter blocks that says Gary. Goody, more fighting. Oh, yep, yeah, there is a ton of ghouls. I forgot about them. Oh, here we go again. How come it's been so long since we worked together, Bobby? I'm feeling eyes on my back. I've been okay, that like it hurt. profile on this one, Mel. And I didn't want to get you wrapped up in it, unless I had to. We've been through worse jobs than this. We're not done yet, are we? Encouraging. Over here, Mel. Got it. Sonia, blast time. McCready, ooh, shut up. He's silly with that shit. No flesh off my face, but you two might want to watch out for the radiation around here. The thing on this one's wrist has a Geiger counter equipped. I'll just keep my ears open for clicks. I don't want to nerd out over it, but a Robco Pip Boy is a rare find, my friend. You're going to have to let me play with it later. Yeah, you're gonna want to take some Radex. Worst time to reload. Oh, up another kill from me. Who's there? Who's there? Who was that? I think that was a legendary down there. I thought there was a legendary over here. Right? 
I see the star on its name? That's weird. Ooh. I kind of like that. I kind of like that a lot. Well, we're not going to need that stuff anymore. We need Sonya here. Gotcha. Sonya. Poor McCready. It's stuck. Sorry, bud. Over here, you can lockpick that safe if you want. I'm not going to bother with that kind of stuff right now. This is kind of a long mission. <laughs> well, here we go again. I keep getting pushed around by these NPCs, man. It's really not that fun. All right. Wouldn't have taken long. Mel, get Sonya over here. No problem. Come on, Sonya. So there's two ways to go. This is the way that we want to go, but we're going to go over here first. A few Meyer lurks we can take care of over here. Safety off. I think we have company. Take out the spotlight if you want. It's not really that big of a deal. Over here, you can lockpick this gate for a fusion core. We're just going to go through this pipe. We're going to have a ton of those stupid fucking um, hatchlings, Meyer Lurk hatchlings. So get ready for that. Mistake you'll ever make. I don't even care if these guys are getting knocked down. It's just they're so in my way. Here we go again. I wasn't even worth wasting my bullets. We need to get through here, Mel. Sonya, you know what to do. Let Mel have Sonya do that. If Sonya can figure out how to get over there. Come on, you stupid robot. My advice to everybody is do a quick save when you're through here. Because this quest can be a bit glitchy and kind of glitch out and you won't be able to complete it sometimes. So I do a quick save now just in case. We're just backtracking a little bit. This sent us in a circle. Just wanted to show everybody some of the stuff you could get over there. It wouldn't be a 100% complete walkthrough if I didn't show everybody how to go through all this stuff. We've already been through all of this. Now we're gonna take this path. What we wanna do is go over to this terminal And then we're going to unlock the door. Be 
Be really careful. We're going to run into a lot of ghouls, and one of them is a bloated, glowing ghoul. Oh, no. This ain't how I go. He's the most dangerous. So take him out first if you can. We're getting really close. There's a brewery near our strong room. This has to be the basement of that brewery. Brewery, you say? Mel, no. Just kidding. If you want to hack this terminal and get in there and loot some stuff, you can. Find anything useful on him? I sure did, bud. Up there is where we want to go. Just showing everybody over here. Always reload at the worst times. Just showing everybody what all paths you can take. Over here, Mel. Got it. Sonia, blast time. Who was that? You again! Find him! Find him! Oh, it woke up one of the ghouls. Oh my god. There we go. Oh, it's crawling on the ground. Okay. Now he's just starting to have fun. Thought I got all the ghouls, but I guess not. Okay, now we're going to have to talk to Mel to continue the quest. Come on, Mel. Don't know where you're at, bud. There you are, bud. Mel. I knew we'd be digging, but I didn't think there would be this much fighting. What's the story with you and Bobby? Well... She swears she used to work with my grandfather when he was about my age. She courted me at the bar in Good Neighbor and kept telling me how I looked just like her dead friend. Yeah, and she was also my great aunt's neighbor's pharmacist. Yeah, well, laugh all you want. I didn't care if it was true. I was just glad to get to do something with my life. I've been working with Bobby ever since and only regretted it occasionally. Mel. I knew we'd be digging, but I didn't think there would be this much fighting. Good work on the robot. Very helpful. Thanks. You know, uh -huh. she just floated right across mm -hmm. like it was... Uh-huh. There should be some dialogue. Mel. If Bobby's directions are correct, and I have my doubts, the strong room should be right through there. If you had anything else you wanted to check out in this tunnel, I suggest you do that first. I'm ready. You got it. Let's do this. Ready, Sonia? I knew there was uh, some dialogue. It was being a little bit glitchy. Not even glitchy, just laggy, I guess, or something. Bobby. Great. Now my socks are wet. Well, guys, we're right under the Diamond City strong room. You sure this is the right place? I've been mapping it out, and I think Diamond City should be a little further north of here. I don't have a doubt in my mind. How about a little trust for the boss? Tell the truth, Bobby. Where are we? Under the Diamond City strong room. And that is the last time I'm saying it. We still need a way to get up there, though. Mel, you think your robot will work here? Look at this place. The foundation is already crumbling. One blast from Sonya, and I bet the floor above will come right down. Well, then make it so. He won't want to be in the room for this collapsing foundation and all. Good thinking. All right, then. Everybody clear out. Sonya, prepare yourself for a blast at maximum power. Here we go. That didn't sound good. I hope Sonya's okay. Now let's get up into that strong room, shall we? Oh, 
no, 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 Sonya! Pull yourself together, Mel. We don't need that thing anymore anyway. But... You can make another robot with the haul we get from the strong room. Keep your head in the game. We're going to go through this door over here. Bobby, what are you doing here? Shit. You seriously didn't think Hancock would catch wind of your scheme? He took you in, Bobby. And you're stealing from him? Don't listen to her. What does this have to do with Hancock? Yeah, about that. As Mel guessed, this isn't the Diamond City strong room. I see the rest of you are in the dark about this. Nice, no-nos. You all just broke into Hancock's storeroom. You know. Hancock. The mayor of Good Neighbor. Damn it, Bobby. Listen, guys. I know this isn't what you expected. But there are still a ton of caps on the line here. Help me take her out, and all of it is ours. This is Hancock we're ripping off here. The guy tends to hold grudges. Counteroffer. Just go back into your tunnel, and we can forget this ever happened. What do you say? Come on, Bobby. At least if we leave now, we leave with our lives. Well, shit. You're right. I'm not one to give up. But I know when I'm outmatched. Let's go. Thank God. I don't know why I trusted you again, Bobby. But that was the last time. You'll get over it. Now let's split before the girl changes her mind. What a waste of time. You made the... <clears throat> you made the right move. Bobby lied to us. I'm glad it shook out this way. I was itching for a fight. But I guess this works too. Here, take this. A token for doing the right thing. Hancock will be happy to hear about your loyalty. You should go pay your respects in person. It's best to stay on Hancock's good side. Trust me. We got another level. Let's go ahead and put it, our last level into perception. Now we have it maxed out. And then we're going to come up here. And then we're going to go out of here into the Commonwealth. Let's go ahead and fast travel to Good Neighbor. We actually were over here earlier in the last video, but we didn't discover it because I knew that we would be coming over here anyways. I'll see everybody in Good Neighbor. Bald suit, huh? Classy. Palling around with McGrady now, huh? Yeah, I've seen worse marks. Mayor Hancock? Well, if it ain't Bobby's little Patsy. Here, for protecting my stash. Why is decision turning on Bobby like that? Bobby tricked me. She got what she deserved. Yeah, that's usually how the story goes around here. <sighs> Let me tell you, this classy little tri-corner hat of mine is getting heavy. Am I turning into the man? Some kind of tyrant? I spend all my time putting down the people I would have been proud to scheme with just a few years ago. I need to take a walk again. Get a grip on what really matters. Living free. If you're heading out, why not come with me? Yeah, I like it. You might just be the right kind of trouble. Let me just have a little chat with my community first. Give them the news. Hey, everybody. Gather up. I got something you all need to hear. No rush. Everyone just take your time. 
Look, everyone, I'm taking a walk. It's time for your fearless leader to get back out there. Mix it up in the dirt before I forget what that feels like. You can't leave, Hancock. We need you. Hey, I'm always gonna be here in spirit, my man. Good neighbor and I, we got a connection. But like any hot and heavy relationship, sometimes you gotta spend time apart. Let things cool off. Remind yourself of who you are. So that's why I'm leaving. I'm still your mayor. I'm still gonna be here when you need me. But it's time for me to stop living so damn comfortable. Because we all know, no one in power deserves to be comfortable for long. Now, what's the best town in the Commonwealth? Where can someone live free with no judgment? Good neighbor! Good neighbor. Of, of the, the people! people. For, for, the for the people! For the people! And don't let no one forget it. Hancock. So, you ready to get this show on the road? Let's do it. Done. Hancock! How's the coolest ghoul in the Commonwealth? Hey, McCready. Don't wait up. Hey. Just say the word. Hey, Hancock. Talk to me. It's time we part ways. Works for me. I'll head on home. Okay, he's gonna head back to Sanctuary, and we're gonna end the video, I think, right here. This is a great spot to hit end the video. Anyhow, with all that being said, I want to start by telling everybody thank you so very much for stopping by and watching the video. It really does mean the world to me. Hopefully you all enjoyed it. If you did, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. If you didn't, hit the thumbs down button. Let me know why down in the comments below. It only helps the channel. Also, if you enjoy content just like this, be sure to subscribe or don't. I don't know. I'm not your dad. Do whatever you want. And like always, everybody, have a good morning, a good afternoon, or a good night, whatever time it may be in your part of the world. Mr. John Wayne, signing off.